Hi everyone, good to see you again. I am Dr. Janine Scott, and I am looking forward to being with you over the next few weeks, sharing the Man of You moment. I was praying about what God wanted me to convey to you. A few things crossed my mind, but one subject jumped into my head and stayed there. It had to do with endings and beginnings, how life is full of them, and how we manage our endings can have an effect on how we enter our beginnings. Also, what may seem like an ending to us is never an ending to God, as He is the God of the resurrection and makes all things new and beautiful in His time. Y'all are going to make me preach. But before I get too far ahead of myself, this is particularly personal to me as I'm getting ready to make a physical move, but it can apply to any move, ending or ending in one's life. No matter where we may be, the one thing that is inevitable is change. Circumstances change, people change, places change, everything changes. Yet there is one that we serve who never changes, our God. He is the first and the last, the beginning and the end, the alpha and the omega, the author and the finisher of our faith. 1 Samuel 15, 29 says that God, who is the glory of Israel, does not lie or change. Psalms 55, 19 says, the God is enthroned from of old, who does not change. Malachi 3, 6 says that I, the Lord, do not change. And James 1, 17 says that every good and perfect gift is from above, coming down from the Father of heavenly lights who does not change. And finally, I think most know this verse, Hebrews 13, eight, which says that Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. He's the one we can count on when everything around us changes. He is the anchor that holds us still and keeps us from drifting away into areas or things that we should not be in. He is the one who is with us in the valleys of life giving us shelter, security, and a peace that goes beyond all understanding. So, as we move through our many endings and beginnings, let us remember and be comforted in knowing that our Heavenly Father, who was and is and is to come, has already been where we are going. He is already there and will love us and guide us when we are there as well. Things may change, but God will never change. His methods may change, his tactics may change, his instruments may change, but he never will. And he will be with us always. Love you. Thanks for joining me for this week's Man of You moment. We'll see you next week.